We're still outside, so we're not wearing a mask, but there's Nanny. I wanted to take her picture. Um, this morning, she's getting her braces. So, of course, I used Hubby's truck, so I parked way, <laughs> way down yonder. You guys know how I am of a driver. But Danny, you excited? All right, take off your mask. This is before braces. Two years later, you guys will see <laughs> her braces off, but um, I'll take a picture with her. Friends, I am here. <laughs> I could have gone through the drive through but I have hubby's truck. So it's just right there, but it means I gotta walk in the rain. And of course, <laughs> I have no umbrella, but it's all good. And then also I learned from my last trip with the dentist of how not having a driver's license nor any form of payment. Um, I switched out my my big wallet to this because with this one i can put it into the little bags um that i choose to have uh or the big bag or just carry it by itself not cool this is a um i don't know if they still have it i bought this last year maybe a year and a half over at our local michael kors um store at the mall and i believe it was called the uh, chain wallet whitney but um, I wanted it in white so that I could kind of just wear it with whatever. But the nice thing about this is that um, you see this little chain here. Let me, and then you see the buckle. Let me unbuckle it. And then when you unbuckle it, <laughs> when you unbuckle it, um, and then this one, I like this too because it reminds me of the, the Louis Vuitton, like a Pochette Matisse, the way it opens. And then inside it's just my cards. It's thick because of all my insurance cards for the kids. Um, but um, it has my, when you pull it out, it has my Costco card that I use. And then it has um, like a see-through card. Um, holder and that's where I put my driver's license but look how easily it can take out so the whole this whole thing can be inside the purse and then uh, this one can just be sticking out um, and then it can like you can have it as a holding on to like such you know what I mean like you know because like when you have a deep purse like the louis vuitton never fall or the coach leather see look i couldn't even use my coach leather bags i'm stuck here should i just try the drive through because it's like raining hard okay so i gotta it's kind of open so i gotta go in because you know it curves like i can do mcdonald's drive through but i cannot do jack in the box um because of the way it curves in and it's so tight but I don't want to brave it because then it's like me trying to brave like a slide when the kids go to like the carnival slides, which is like, woo, woo. Danica will go. And there has been a time when I was like taking Danica up the stairs of like a pumpkin patch slide. And then I had to tell like other three or two year olds like, um, excuse me, child, move out of the way. Of course, I didn't say it that way, but in my head. I was panicking. Move out of the way so I can go back down. I can't go down the slide. They're all looking at me like, just go down the slide. Just go. I'm like, I can't. Oh. Oh. Dear Lordy. Um, she said it was about at least two hours because they also have to do cleaning on her. Ooh, I think the rain stopped. And that's the thing with um, Seattle. Danielle. Danielle's toys. You should see Danielle's car. She has these because she's into Hello Kitty. Which I'm so happy because I was really into Hello Kitty. Um, like Danica's age and then Danny's age and then Danielle's age and then even now. <laughs> so I like it when the girls are into. I'm not so much into Hello Kitty although I can't say that. Hold on. Let me just, oh, although I, 
um, my bracelets that hubby gets me. This is the Alex and I think it's called Alex and Ani. Um, it was after Christmas, before New Year. So maybe I ordered it on the thirty. Ordered it. Maybe I ordered it on the thirtieth from Alex and Ani website. But I had gotten a uh, Aloha charm. And then it was a Hello Kitty, the classic Hello Kitty charm. Because I was going to get um, get it for Danielle for her to start her little collection. But she's not... Danielle doesn't show interest in girly things. That girl... That girl, I offered to buy her a Louis Vuitton Neverfull uh, for college. Just like a part of her graduation um, gift. And... Cause she was supposed to go away into the dorm and i said a never fold would be nice because you know it's a tote bag you can uh, it's classic you'll have it forever and she's like mom i don't need those can you just buy me um what'd she say what, what did she wanted not birkenstocks what's the other one uh martin doc martin yeah she goes mom can i just buy can you just buy me a doc martin shoes i really want those but actually she bought them because I ended up getting her a very um, expensive uh, necklace uh, of uh, Hawaiian gold that said her Hawaiian name. Because when she turned 18, it's um, she got her Hawaiian name from her kumu. Uh, kumu is a hula teacher, but not all hula teachers can be called kumu. Kumu is a title given to... Uh, it, it's passed down by other kumus. A kumu can only, a kumu can only be called a kumu by another kumu. <laughs> uh, and they're Hawaiian teachers. Oh, it stopped. Okay, I'm gonna go get my coffee. with you I should have brought my little stand oh see this is why I should have brought my stand <laughs> I got uh, cold brew not the see that's why I, I don't like to order things uh, I don't like to try new, new things at like Starbucks because once I'm in line like I don't I, I have anxiety holding people up behind me or I have anxiety making the person I'm talking to feel uncomfortable <laughs> just a, you know because in my head I know what I want expressing it may not be the case but um I like um Starbucks cold um wait I like Starbucks uh sweet cream cold brew so in my head that's what I was ordering is a sweet cream but she goes, oh, we can flavor it anyway. I go, okay, well, can I try the pistachio um, cold brew? She goes, oh, sure. And then when I got it, I'm like, where's all the milk? <laughs> you know, like sometimes they have like the drizzle of milk around. So it's just pistachio cold brew. But I can't say I'm complaining because I haven't even tried it yet. So let me try and you guys are wondering, like, you're getting a cold brew when it's raining and cold? I like it, but I like the sweet cream cold brew. I like pistachio. Mm. So, I don't, re I don't really order something for myself at Starbucks. I just ordered the tumblers. Oh, speaking of tumblers, I hope you guys were able to grab, if you had wanted to the new um uh, valentine's day release or do they just call it like a january release which i because they release valentine's day tumblers along with like i think like a spring collection and i showed you a little bit of that when i was um waiting for my uh food there was really nobody there i think there was one person there 
and they have like the lavender. I'm looking for the, ooh, wait. I'm looking for the, um, like the lavender, which I called a Starbucks and had them hold it for me because Miss Katie, hi Miss Katie. Um, Miss Katie bought one and Miss Katie is my virtual bae. We have never seen each other, but through YouTube, uh, she is my um, twinsy. We're so much alike. I even bought her one of these sweaters. So, Miss Katie, she watches because <laughs> I know that's. <laughs> I don't know why anybody watches, but anyway, Miss Katie, this is the sweater um, that I bought to match with you. <laughs> I showed her a picture this morning, but um, anywho, what was I say? Oh, um, Starbucks, yeah. I it's I like the cold brew sweet cream better. But I w I'm wondering if you can still flavor it with like pistachio or whatever they have. Oh, well, no, that's not what I was talking about. I was already after that. I think, oh, like I don't, I, I when I'm in line, I feel like, um, have you, you guys ever watch, um, Seinfeld with the soup, soup Nazi? You know, you just say what you want to say. And even if you said it wrong, you just move on. That's how I am with ordering stuff. Like, I just say what I want to say. And if it didn't come out right, I just move on. <laughs> All right, friends. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see, but you see that red car? So there's a part. So there's a red car over there. There's no car until way on the other side of the building. And there was no car beside me when I parked here. And you guys know I have issues with parking. Here's a lady that parked right next to me. Here's a guy that parked right next to me. <laughs> I swear I tell hubby, like your truck is like a magnet for people to park next to you. Um, I don't know why people do that though. Because I'm the kind of person that parks like opposite of how they park. Like away from people i would rather park there from that parking spot next to the red car all the way over there empty but they park right next to me i guess it's not their fault i mean they don't realize that i have anxiety issues ocd hot mess of an issue cannot drive 60 year old woman in a big old truck i don't know what i'm doing it ain't their fault it's me so now I'm going to back it up. <laughs> Park elsewhere. Danny's here. Danny, take off your mask. There's nobody around. Danny's always like encouraging us to take off our mask. Ooh, what color? Turquoise? Mm -hmm. Let me see. I like it. Oh, You're happy about that, huh? It's pretty cool. All right, let's go take your picture. It. Yeah. But I like that color. Remember, they showed you all the colors. But the thing is, you, you can change. Yes. <laughs> um, I like that color though. Turquoise. I think Ate did every color in the rainbow. And then your brother only chose, I think, blue. Blue and black, maybe? But mostly blue. But your Danielle had pink, turquoise, black, white, uh, yellow. Huh. Oh, here. This is where I was parked. <sighs> Does it hurt? Yeah, oh, that's good. Okay, friends. So over here, it's just a very easy um, dish that I don't even have a recipe for. Babe, when you go to a Chinese restaurant and you get that egg soup, what do you call it? Fo egg fo young? Um, I just call it egg soup. Egg soup. <laughs> you guys know what we're referring to, the egg soup. I uh, when you get it at the Chinese restaurant, they just give you like a very like bland, neutral um, egg soup. Um, so that's exactly what this is, but in my own version. So I just put uh, more flavoring to it. I have zucchini because I happen to have an extra zucchini. Ooh. And then tomatoes, and then it was onion, and then I added uh, tofu, and then um, the eggs. So I sauteed all those first, except for the tofu. I sauteed all the veggies first and then I added um, the eggs that I've already scrambled into a bowl uh, with salt and pepper. Okay, and then I cooked it. 
so that it has these little chunks in there. And then once it was almost done, then I added just water and then I flavored it. I flavored it with uh, chili paste, some salt and pepper and then chili, uh, chili paste. And then over here, and then I'm boiling water to add some of this, which is the vermicelli Korean style sweet potato starch noodles. Okay, for Danny because she just got her braces today, so easy for her to be able to eat something. Um, she can easily just have this with broth. Um, and then they'll have the protein of the tofu and the eggs and the veggies. And then they'll warm her up. And then she can also have it with the noodles, cut it up into smaller, uh, smaller pieces. And then that's it. That's what the kids will have. Really quick, Michaels. I'm looking for the Valentine's Day stuff, but I don't think they have any. Welcome to our cottage. I don't know. Mm. Mm. Ooh, I really like this one. Mm. I found my ornament, so it comes in a pack like this, and I think $9.99 for $10. Okay, for those, and then these ones, these ones, the small ones. But okay. right, here's their Valentine's Day stuff. This one's all pink. These are the ones I saw. Now these ones. That one. Mm. Okay, this is the other section, like spring, I think. The new spring release. Oh, this is pretty. 